all in my family. It's not specific what my parents want me to study. I can choose what I want to study. They will tell me like it will be harder for you to find a job in that certain area. But if you want to study that subject or for example, I want to go study languages. At first they were kind of hesitant because they didn't know if I can find a job with that faculty, but they were open for it. Uh, I think there's not um, a strain or responsibility you can do with your life, well, what you want. Uh, it just uh, depends on what your wishes are and what you want to be in the future. How do you feel about it? Oh, how I feel about it? Um, I, I think it's great because you have the freedom, like, you can make your own plan, you have wishes, and if you're uh, ambitious enough, you can make it. So I think it's really cool. Well, uh, mostly my dad, and not because of his gender, but because he knows how to do it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, my mom just never took interest in uh, cars or computers or something like that so my dad is major for fixing stuff uh, while my mom is like those ongoing stuff like uh, washing the washing the clothes <laughs> ironing and that and that's the only solid division we have in our family uh, my mom is washing the clothes and ironing them and everything my dad is uh, changing the tires repairing the car or something like that but everything else is divided equally so they both cook they both wash dishes vacuum clean or something like that uh, not mostly not there are some jobs that you cannot do as a male as I tried to explain earlier uh, you you can applicate from them but they won't hire you because you're a male because it just needs a woman to do that and there's it goes other way around so if you're a woman you cannot do some like you can want to become a truck driver if you're a woman but hardly that you will be a truck driver yeah, man, uh, yeah, man, uh faktisk, at øh, det er ikke meget forskelligt fra Danmark. Øh, en en af, 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 de, af de mere øh, positive ting ved, ved den socialistiske arv er jo, at, at det jo formelt set bare var meget øh, progressivt i forbindelse med, med kvinders øh, plads på, på arbejdsmarkedet. Øh, så derfor så har de ikke sådan en, øh, en, en gammel konservativ arv, der, der øh, der, 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 der er sådan hæmmende der. Når, når det er sagt, så er det klart, at, at der er øh, dels er der mand og kvindefag, som, som, som vi kender det fra resten af verden. Øh, dels er der også en, øh, en, en, en øh, måske en lidt, lidt kedelig tendens til, at øh, i nogle stillinger bliver kvinder ikke taget helt nok alvorligt, hvis man ser Uh, en, uh, en paneldebat eller sådan noget lignende på, på Service Fjernsyn. De er ikke særlig gode til at få, få kvindelige eksperter ind, uh, som, som i sådan en, en, en synlig uh, rolle uh, sige der. Men, men uh, generelt så, så tror jeg, at, at det er uh, rimelig, rimelig veludviklet, altså et, at det, det, det er et åbent arbejdsmarked for, for begge køn. Well, I don't know yet. I have time, like I have a year and a half more to think of it. Uh, I will go to university, that's for sure, because with gymnasium I cannot get any kind of job. Uh, so, I don't know, that's it. I will go to faculty, <laughs> that's for sure. <laughs> Uh, well, first I want to graduate from high school, then apply for University of Belgrade Faculty of Mathematics. 
Uh, and after that, I get my diploma. That's like my short plan of the future. Uh, well, like I said, I want to study languages, uh, English, Italian and Scandinavian. And also I want to study interior or graphic design. <laughs> <laughs>